change your life. And it's just like the ripple effect. We can trace it back to this moment. It has nothing to do with how much money you're making. It has to do with your commitment to helping people. It has to do with how much you care. The only way to be successful in business is to continually step outside your comfort zone. I just got done seeing Robin Crane this morning. All of her friends have been talking about it all morning long. She's so engaging, such a great speaker. You guys have been asking, who is the financial G-spot chick? and I have her here today. You want to build your business, you make it happen. Because you get to drive them to get what they finally want. She gave us a lot of actionable steps and she was so interesting. She told so many great stories and she really inspired us to do better for ourselves and for our clients. I would definitely recommend coming to see her and I'll be back to see her again. I feel like most people, knowing how to save money is just as big as the problem of knowing how to manage your money. Robin Crane is the author of the number one best-selling book, Mind Over Money Management. Really, it was about focus and understanding who I work with and how to provide so much value to the person and change their life. I mean, it sounds kind of cheesy, but that's what I did. I believe when you make more money, you help more people. Discover Robin Crane's blueprint in her new book, Make More Money, Help More People. When I knew I worked with women and how to help them and I focused on that, I was able to really transform lives and that's why I have the book Make More Money, Help More People. And what I found with women is that we have this tendency to not believe in ourselves and lack confidence. What I believed for the longest time was that I have to change those beliefs. My biggest breakthrough is knowing who I really am, my confidence, my self-assurance that I am the expert of my field. And for the first time in my life, I am so clear that I am the one because I was here. Borrowing Robin's belief will allow me to believe and succeed. I call it the belief loan phenomenon, which is really how you shift your beliefs by borrowing the belief from a mentor and take the action or do the behavior anyway. You'll get some positive results. So you went from making $500 in a year to making half a million. I'm spending time this morning to work on your beliefs and to at least get you to a point that you will borrow my beliefs. You'll believe me enough to borrow the beliefs because that's gonna help you get the results. So I'm enrolling you so that you actually will go out and take action. Some of you might think, okay, cool. If she can turn around and then two years later make half a million dollars in the same business, I can do that too. And that's what's most important to me. It's not about me looking cool, me looking good. What's most important that I help build the belief that any of you can do this. Well, you've learned a lot over the years then because now you are a host of Financial G-Spot. You've got your radio show, <laughs> Let's Talk Money, on top of that. You have appeared on everything from The Motley Crew, I mean, The Motley Fool to... Motley uh, Crew, that's a different show. show. <laughs> I, I mean, you've done it all. What got me through to the other side was being able to get a coach and, and help me implement things. If you're considering having Robin speak at your event, don't even think about it. Just book her. <laughs>